All right, Chul Kim is going to be officiating. Uh, this is, you keep, don't, don't, don't leave anywhere. Keep your eyes on this, on the screen. He hasn't fought for three years. And last time he fought, he was in the Bantamweight. So this is a challenge for him uh -oh. to become a featherweight fighter. Uh-oh. I can't believe it's been that long. It seems like just last year or something. And here we go. That Mikuro Asakura had a chance to witness uh, the first loss for his brother Kai. So Asakura is, doing the, uh, is in the south, southpaw position. He likes to throw left hand and left kicks. Kill switched to southpaw as well. And then back to orthodox. Sabi MMA fighters are really good at it. They switch stances to take advantage of the position. Okay, Mikuro reading uh, his opponent very well, Kiru. That very snappy right left uh, hook. Very nice kick counter to the inside. by Mikuro. Mm -hmm. Going high. Mikuru just looks so at home. He's just bouncing around. Mm -hmm. Looks really calm. He's very strong against orthodox fighters. It's a good strategy for Kilu to get the southpaw. It will be really distracting for him. There oh, we go. And he did distract him. Right strategy. Jumped in there, got in a little... Uh, Jab hook. He goes for the takedown. Mm -hmm. Mikuro blocked it. Yeah, really well. He started from too far. That's the thing with the takedown. You really got to set it up really well. You get a strike first, then drop down. Oh, oh my God. God. Oh. Wow. This wow. is Kiro's okay. chance. Uh -huh. Can right. Mikuro survive this? He's trying to, yeah, he's Mikuro trying to grab almost, anything. Uh -huh. Mikuro, oh my god, Mikuro survived it. Still taking a lot of shots. Okay, Kilo ended on top mount. He's got the full mount, he's going to look to try to posture up and start pounding. Mikuro's got an over, over underhook. Kilo's just using that shoulder to try to, try to create some space. Okay, the back choke, he was looking for. Yeah, he's oh, under he's the chin. It. He just doesn't have the hooks in, doesn't have a good back position. Okay, it's... The grip is right, but... Shouldn't waste energy there. Okay, wow, okay. back up. Nikuru survived it. Not sure if Mikura, uh, Mikura was able to shake all that off. Kilo closing distance. Oh! oh. Mikura is looking for a kick there. Closing distance. Nice jab by Mikuro. Killer went for the right hand, then dropped down for the single. Couldn't get it. Mikuro Mik has the guillotine. Yeah, he, he has it. He has it. Cranking it's it. He's cranking okay. it. Okay. Kilo survived he's it. Kilo's out. He's looking to. Yeah, he's working his way towards the back. Nice escape from the guillotine. We only he have the 40 seconds in the first round. Yeah, is he going to try? I don't, think, I don't think he's going to try suplex. He might try drag him to the floor. There we go. There we go. Looking for the back again. 
Right, Kido applying constant pressure. Okay, Mikuru ended in uh, inside position. Doesn't have enough time for any submission hold. Okay. Wow. What an impressive performance by Kido. It is. I mean, all it took was one hit. I mean, I've never seen Mikuru in a situation like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he was definitely in trouble. He looked really comfortable before that. Well, Mikuru is still standing in his corner though. He opted not to sit on the chair. He's standing up. He looks really fresh still. Or he wants us to think. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> perhaps, perhaps. That's a good strategy as well because you know, I mean, that's what you're looking at. You're look looking at across at your opponent during these um, short in-between round breaks. Sure. I think everybody has a look at their opponent just to see how they're looking. Are they gassed? And the second round. Mikuru who's pressing forward. Doing a lot of fake moves. Oh, you get that kick. Now oh, that hurt. Yeah. That hurt. That hurt. It really wobbled Kido. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mikuru is setting it up. Oh, oh yeah. He tried to go for an, another wow. uh -huh. leg kick to the outside of uh, uh -huh. Kido's right leg, but. Uh, that was reminiscent of Aragelli. Yeah. That sound. Well, it's not as bad. Though. It was only. It's not as it, was, bad. It, was, it was still. Yeah. <laughs> <Thank> <laughs> God, <laughs> I'm looking at Aragelli over it. there. Uh -huh. Aragelli's over is. there, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he's going, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Getting the blanket out. So they're checking to see if it's still there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> checking <laughs> if it's not <laughs> broken. If it's not broken. Oh. oh! I think it very well could be. And then, and then the camera shot is going to go to a regular again. <laughs> Oh, yeah. that's uh, that's bad. It was just a position change at that moment. Yeah, they're the main kind of factors, I think, you know, with these low blows. Oh. Just the slide See, change is that position. It's that disgusting, that, that hollow sound. It's like, mm. it's like a, you know, it's a, it's a weird sound <laughs> that, that it forms, the cup itself, you know. But it was 20% of a rigole. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, I was, uh, I was right here. You, 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 were, you, were, you were here, you know? Yeah, yeah. Point two Arigale, I said. Yeah, it was 20% of Arigale. And Arigale spent uh, the night in the hospital, got yeah. discharged, and went back because of the recurring pain. This is not good. This is 50% uh, power down. <laughs> yeah. Really, like... <laughs> Even though you can get up, you're not the same you before you get kicked. I mean, what are you supposed to do? Are you supposed to ice it in that situation? I mean, what are you supposed to do? You should have to wait. Just wait? Mm -hmm. You wait, you get up. As I mentioned, you get the 50% power down. You're not <laughs> the same you. <laughs> and then you go home and ice it. 
like uh, you know all these fighters who get who get kicked and wins. Yeah, they are the true winners. Wait, Chris Barnett also. Uh, that really yeah. threw Chris Barnett. Yeah, didn't it, it did. Yeah. It did. And Chris yeah. Barnett, he didn't take enough time. Even right now, Kuno should take a little bit more time. Just use it. Use use the whole five minutes that you have. Yeah. And you shouldn't rush straight back into the fight. Just <clears throat> kind of ease your way back. Oh, that could have been bad. Mm -hmm. That could have been really bad, but Kido got out of it in time. He's going for the shoot. And he gets... Kido's angry. I can see that. <laughs> he had some success in the first round on the ground, so perhaps he's looking to drag it back down there. Mm -hmm. Well, great defense uh, from Asakura. He's so strong on his feet. And there's Kido going for the dead leg. Knees to the outside of the left. I know Kido has prepared so much for this because uh, I know he competed several Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu tournament for this. Up. And Asakura turns it around. Another guillotine. He's trying. And a takedown. And then, wow, Kido gets got a takedown. Yeah. But Straight into side. He's got side control. He's got plenty of time, three minutes. Three minutes to work. This is definitely something that Asakura is not used to. He's used to ending his fights early. Wow. We're two minutes into nice the second escape. round, but great, great escape. You got to be careful. Asakura still has those snappy hooks. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh. Those kicks. All right, Kido tries to return. Yeah. You can see the way uh, Kido moves. He's still yeah, a bit. Yeah, no, he's hurt. He doesn't yeah. want to. He doesn't want to expose his right leg. And there's another chance. You see how it's already red, and it's you know it's turning purple right now as we speak. Some of the guys will tell you that they'd rather get hit on the head than uh, than low kicks. Those are the most painful. They say. Yeah, when those low, click, low kicks start to mount up, you start taking a lot of damage. Um, it's difficult to walk. I mean, the next day, it's sometimes hard oh. just getting up. Oh, yeah, I could imagine. I mean... Well, Kilo's not doing anything right now. He should uh, set up that mm -hmm. takedown that he kept going for earlier. There it is. Yeah, see, he's just not setting it up well enough. Oh! Oh. Nice exchange. He needs a few more punches. Just try and draw Asakura's guard up, get him covering up, and then drop down and take him, take his legs out from underneath him. At the moment, Azakura, he knows like the takedown will probably be coming, so he's defending really well. One minute. Oh, nice head kick. Azakura, just a nice combination of low kicks, high kicks, going everywhere. A variety of attacks kind of throwing him off. And a swing. Whoa. Nice right hook from Igeru. Is he going to have the takedown? Wow. Yes, he does. We have less than 40 seconds left in the first round. I think it's from here, yeah, Kilu's got his arm and head trapped, so it's difficult to posture up. He needs to posture up and start pounding, but yeah, he should really use that right hand, try to prize Azakura's arm off. Okay, um, this position is uh, how they're going to end the second round. Rather um, a surprising match. I, I didn't think it was going to go this far. I, I'll be honest with you, I, you know, I was expecting something big from Mikuru. 
Um, but the surprise is Jidu Kim, or Jidu Lee. Yeah, he's definitely bringing the fight. It's those trips that are getting him the takedown, even the double leg against the fence, he had to use a slight trip. And the third and final round, Asakura versus Lee. He's going for that low kick again. Kiru's cornerman asked him for a high kick. Nice right hook and, a and he gets the takedown. As he tried to work his way up, that's immediate one point. Free up that right leg. Yeah. I would take out yeah my left arm from behind his head, push on the neck, release that grip of Azakura's. He's still, yeah, he's doing well, prizing his leg out though from half guard. Oh, wow. As Akura turns and he's take. Oh, wow. he didn't get the back because of the arm. Mm -hmm. Let's see what Azakura can do here with his pounding. Gilu looks more technical in the ground than Asakura. Yeah, he's going to use the fence to stand up now. He's up, but he ate a couple of shots. <laughs> There's that kick, dude. Mm -hmm. Three minutes left. Okay, this is uh, so tense. You don't know what's going to happen. Yeah, I think Azakura has really got to do something, you know. Try to get a bit of momentum before the end of the fight. Yeah, Kiro's shooting for a takedown again. If Guillotine again. Guillotine's corner warning him to watch out for a guillotine. Yeah, Asakura's looking for the guillotine as his last resort. Kilo went for a nice little ankle pick and then he got a good grip for the double leg. See whether he can take him down from here. Asakura's got his left arm in though, the underhook and his blocking. The double, he switched back to the single now, Kilo. He's opting to try and weaken the legs of Azakura. I think he knows he's not just going to get a straight takedown. He's going to have to trip him or do something special. Stop, Referee calls a break. <laughs> Last minute. Let's see what these guys can do. Oh, oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. 
You know, the, uh, you, the timing is, is fabulous because right when he's not expecting it, you know, he's getting him, he's mixing it up. That was a great shoot. And great defense from uh, Mikura. Mikuru. Mikuru. This is Mikuru's last chance. He's desperately looking for that submission. He's got the single. He tries to leg trip. Now he's trying to grip those hands. He's got just the, uh, he's got the grip. He's going to try and pick him up. Ten seconds. He's really got to try. Try to finish this takedown. It'll be a big statement at the end of the round. He's just looking short, short knees. Is it, this is one of uh, Mikiru's only fights to go this far. That is right. This distance. Good job on um, Kido Kim on not giving up and keep getting the position, even 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 though mm -hmm. you know he's been facing a lot of. Uh, Hard outside kicks to his low, uh, his thigh. And if you get a close up on it, if you could, if you could catch it, I mean, you, you'll see that he took a lot to the inside as well as the outside. Yeah, he's got a lot of bruising on both uh, thighs. I think. With the takedowns and the control, really, Kilu is taking it for me. Okay, this is the official result. It's a unanimous. Wow! There he goes, he takes it. Wow! Good win. And in Mikuru, yeah. his first defeat. Ah, yeah, yeah. Um, Mikuru is walking over to his corner like he can't believe it, uh -huh. but you gotta believe it. I mean, Asakura brothers were undefeatable like in, in Japan, but. Yeah. But one loss in their career is not, you know, you don't lose everything, right? So. But this might be really painful for him. Yeah, it's going to be hard to take his first loss. I'm sure he's going to come back though and uh, fight it, fight a lot more in Road FC.